Hello everyone. In this video, I am going to create a truss for a butterfly roof in Revit. I had already uploaded a video about trusses on my channel. The link is given in the description box. Before we start, I want to remind you to like and share my videos, leave a comment below and subscribe to my channel. And don't forget to watch other videos that are available on my channel. Also, if you have any kind of difficulty or query related to Revit, you can ask me anytime. So now let's start. Open new architectural template page in Revit. First of all, I'm going to place uh, two walls on the floor plan, which I have connected to level two. In the structure tab, select truss, load a truss from the uh, library, library. Make sure you choose a flat truss. And then place it on, the, on these walls. I'm going to place two truss at the start and one at the end of these walls. In the elevation move them so that they are at the top of these walls then draw another level and let's make it at 20 feet no let's do it at the 30 feet Then go to level 3 floor plan and make sure you can see the walls of the uh, in this level 3 as well. Then select roof and create a rectangular boundary for the roof. Select and uncheck this define slope as and then with the help of the slope arrow define slope for the roof select these arrows and give it a height offset of minus 8 feet so that it is 8 feet below at level 3 then select and attach the trusses to this roof which you have just drawn and you can see that how easily the truss has been connected to the roof for example if you don't want to keep the bottom cord in the straight line for that double click on the truss click OK and draw the top cord and the bottom cord lines according to your choice according to the according to the design demand I'm going to keep the bottom cord inclined as well I don't want to keep it straight And then exit this edit mode. Repeat this process on the other truss as well or you can either copy and paste it on the other side. And now you can see that how easily you can edit the truss for this butterfly roof. So that's all for today. I hope you like this tutorial. If you have any kind of difficulty or query related to Revit, you can ask me anytime. I will beat you guys in the next video till then goodbye and take care and most importantly don't forget to like share and subscribe.